Caught on camera, passengers on board a sightseeing ship had a rough end to their excursion Thursday in San Diego. A violent jolt with the pier sent seven people to the hospital. It is named the Adventure Hornblower, but this was not the adventure these passengers had in mind. We just kind of grabbed onto the side of the ship and, and hanged on because we knew we were going to hit. I was about eight inches away from the wall and it just hit. Shortly before one o'clock, the cruise ship rammed into a wall near the Broadway Pier. From the dock, Lena Evans, who works at a bayfront parking lot, could see there was something wrong with the ship. I heard a honk, honk, honk crash and turn to see the boat crashing into the front out there. I see it come in all the time, yeah. Carlene Cahill, who also works at the wharf, saw a ship going too fast to stop. She was coming in faster than normal. She actually was coming in faster than normal. Investigators with the San Diego Fire Department say crew members complained about a problem with the ship's propulsion system just before the collision. I heard a lot of yelling and I yelled, brace yourself, but I don't think any of them heard it. Aboard the ship, passengers Deb and Mike Ellis also saw the trouble looming ahead. Four whistle blasts before we hit. The, the captain did four whistle blasts and it scattered everybody on the dock. And I just slammed up against there, my head, and my arms and everything uh, hurt my back. There were 139 passengers and five crew members on board. Seven of them were injured, although the injuries were not life-threatening. It was a pretty hard, traumatic uh, impact. Three people who complained of back and neck pain were taken to the hospital. There was one girl that hit her head up there uh, real bad. They had to put her in a neck brace and everything. Behind me, some lady that they took to the hospital fell and hit her head on the, on the deck and then slid as she did that. So I think she was hurt kind of bad. As emergency crews secured the seawall and tended to the injured, other passengers waited patiently for their turn to leave the ship. The 22-year-old ship offers dinner cruises, chartered events, and whale-watching tours.